New synthetic drugs are designed to produce identical effects to illegal hard drugs like cocaine, amphetamines, marijuana and ecstasy. New synthetic drugs include bath salts, synthetic marijuana, fake speed and coke and so-called herbal ecstasy. These drugs might be synthetic, but the effects are as real as it gets. They were legally sold at suburban herb shops, adult shops and tobacconists, where they were way more accessible than the drugs they imitate. But a new law made them illegal. And our brief from Crime Stoppers was to educate users that they were illegal and harmful and to generate reports on dealers. We developed the new synthetic drugs Real Damage campaign. But the real hitting power for this campaign came from one key insight. Our insight was this. Once the retail sales channels were shut down, users would turn to online channels to get their drugs using their mobile devices to do it. So we included the names of popular synthetic drugs in the natural search for our campaign site, stopthedamage.com.au. But we wanted more hitting power to reach our audience. And Google had never, ever sold illegal drug names as search terms before. But in a world first, they changed their corporate policy for the Real Damage campaign. They allowed Crime Stoppers to buy new synthetic drug names as search terms against an AdWords campaign. But given the dealers constantly changed their product names and packaging to avoid detection, we had to make sure we were talking the right language. So we visited the police evidence room and got lists of drug names from recent drug squad seizures. We used these as search terms in ads linking to stopthedamage.com.au, a mobile optimised campaign site. This was part of an approach that generated amazing results. But best of all, drug buyers are being served Crime Stoppers messages as they search for drugs. They'd be forgiven for being paranoid about doing it again. Talk about a bad deal for users.